guys, welcome back to my channel. I feel like I haven't done a sit down, more formal video in such a long time. So today we are doing what's in my bag, but a little twist. It is my mini Palm Springs backpack from Louis Vuitton. I'm obsessed with this. This is like my everyday bag when I'm not going to work. It fits everything. It's so cute and small and I love how long the straps are. I did want to inform you that I took off the bottom leather straps. When you buy this bag, there's four pieces of leather that you get. The bottom pieces have clips, but I've actually done the Hey Carmen hack. I call it the Hey Carmen hack. You just loop the leather around the D-ring and it shortens the straps. So mine is on the longest setting and I've looped it around and I skipped one hole. The first hole is um, actually where the D-ring is and then this is the second hole. So I like my backpacks really long and I like the way it feels. It kind of sits on my lower back and I just like that style personally. And I do wear this as a backpack. I don't wear it as a crossbody, but I could. That's a really neat thing about this bag. So I guess I will say I use this four days out of the week and then I use my never full three days out of the week. This bag is just perfect. And I feel like I'm a Hey Carmen wannabe. <laughs> Because I have both of her like bags, you know, the one that she uses for work and then the one that she uses every day. But she got more bags, which makes me feel better because like I'm not really interested in those. So I'm definitely not like totally wanna be totally copycat. I also wanted to mention that I did a whole unboxing on this bag. So if you want to watch that, I will link it down below in my whole Louis Vuitton playlist so you guys can binge watch those videos. I love luxury. And if I was like a millionaire, I would totally be like Mel in Melbourne, if you guys know who she is, classiest lady on YouTube. So check out my playlist down below. Anyway, let's just get on into this video. Um, the first thing I wanted to address is this tripod. This little mini tripod for vlogging will fit in here. So here's a size comparison so you guys can see. This will in fact fit in here. This is the Manfrotto tripod. A lot of vloggers use it. It will fit in here and I'll show you guys after I empty this thing out but with everything I carry in here, it will not fit. I actually saw this one person fit an entire water bottle in here. So this is really, really big. It's a very deceiving bag because it looks small, but it can fit a lot. So diving on in here. First of all, we have my sunglasses. I got this case. There was like a pack of three that came from Amazon. There was a light pink version, a gray version, and a black version. So I carry my sunglasses in this little pouch when I carry my mini backpack because there's not a lot of room for the actual glasses case. The actual Ray-Bans case, again, will fit in that bag, but I carry a lot in there, especially for what the bag can hold. So I keep them in this little pouch. So these are just the Ray-Ban hexagonal shape and I'm obsessed with these go-to sunglasses. The next thing I have in here is my phone. This is the iPhone 10s Max. The next thing that takes up the most room, and this is actually one of the reasons why I got the bag, was because it fits my new vlog camera. This is the Canon M50. Sometimes it's hard to get out. It is the Canon M50 with a 11 to 22 millimeter lens. This whole mirrorless camera fits in here. Um, and how I put it in is I just kind of like tuck it in and it goes sideways. It stands up kind of like that. So it's like on its side rather than on the lens or on the back. So I find that having the lens facing outward, it protects the lens from getting scratched because it's like sideways and nothing is touching it. The next thing I have in here are my keys. There's this really cute keychain that I shared on my Instagram story. It's from Ty Paley. Love her and her work. It's the little like emoji thing from Instagram and it's light pink. I love it. The next thing I have in here is a little hair tie. I don't even know if you can see it. Oh, there you go. You can kind of see it against my skin, but it's just a little hair tie. That's in case if I forget a hair tie and I need to tie my hair back. The next thing on the bottom of the bag, I keep these two coupons for the copper closet because 
I know when I go shopping, I'll probably be using this bag. I just kept these at the bottom of the bag, so when I'm shopping, if I'm there, I'll be like, yes, I have a coupon. And I actually have two because one of the girls was really nice and she let me keep my one before and she gave me another one. So that is everything in the main big compartment in this thing, as you guys can see, kind of. It's really hard. The only thing, this flap is weird. It, it only like bends like this. And it does kind of, it doesn't crease, but it, there's like this little dent, but it looks like all the bags have that. So it's not that big of a deal to me. And I mean, you need to get in your bag somehow. So that's what, how I get into it. Then there's this back pocket and I'll show you guys a close up uh, in just a minute. And I just keep my wallet. This is a card holder from Kate Spade. Then I have my birth control pills and my rule of thumb is keep my birth control pills where my wallet is. So I'll always have them and you know, when it comes time to like take it, I'll always have it. Um, that's kind of how I remember to take it and I have like a reminder on my phone. And that is everything in this part of the bag. Here's the little pocket that I was talking about. That's where I keep my wallet and birth control. And then this little baby, this little front pouch, let's talk about this front pouch. I can barely get it opened and closed. So I keep it open and I can barely get my fingers through here. So I will show you guys what I have, but it's gonna be a little bit of a struggle. I keep some band-aids cause you know, you always gotta have some band-aids on hand. You never know if you're gonna be wearing shoes that are uncomfortable. Oh, this is a little piece for my camera. It's, I'm not gonna do it close up. It doesn't really matter, but it goes where the microphone where you slide the microphone in. I'm not doing a very good job describing this, but this is a little piece from my camera from my M50 that I don't wanna lose. So I put that in there. I forgot that was in there. And then lastly, I have a camera battery and this is just an extra fully charged battery. So if I'm vlogging and it dies on me, I have another extra charged battery. So this little pocket can fit a lot. It's just hard to get in and out of and I wouldn't recommend like putting something you need to get access to on a regular basis in there. And I just keep it open because the zipper is just so hard to get open and closed that it's just not worth closing it. Honestly, nothing's gonna fall out of here cause it's very tight. So yeah, that that's pretty much it for the what's in my bag part. I wanted to kind of give you an overview of some items, a couple items that you could fit in here that I don't have in here. So the first being, like I said earlier, is this tripod. I know a lot of you guys vlog or have your own channels or I don't know, just for a size comparison you wanna know. Um, but this is a tripod, a mini tripod, and it fits perfectly in here. If you stand it up, you can see she fits. She's comfy. The next item I wanted to show you that fits in here very comfortably is a Ray-Bans standard glasses case or sunglasses case, whatever. A case will fit in here. It fits in really comfortably as you guys can see. It has a lot of room. Last but not least, a full-size wallet. It's a little tight, but it fits. So I kind of needed to squish it in there. As you guys can see, it's like squished. I had to like slide it in, but it does fit. I honestly wouldn't suggest putting a full size wallet in here because it's a tight squeeze. See, like that. So I wouldn't recommend it, but if you really had to, then you could if you really needed to. But I don't use full size wallets because I think I don't need that many cards. So that my friends is it for what is in my mini Palm Springs backpack. If you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.